Hey, what's happening, ladies and gentlemen? Stephen Davidson here in a shave video. I've got about, let's see, three days, four days worth of beard growth, so let's get this puppy started. I've had it in the shower. I've had it soaking while I was in the shower. My Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements Atomic Brush. I'm going to prep my face off camera with Barbasol 1919. Going with a leaf and a twig. Fifth shave on one of these bad boys. And it's still, this, this, this shave right here is uh, going to tell me a story for sure. Because I've never, ever in the last four years of wet shaving... Had a blade go more than three shaves anymore. Since my beard, since I get older and our beards get tougher, uh, yeah, I've never had one go this far before. Outside of a feather blade and a Balzano Super Inox, but uh, we'll see what happens with this one. Fifth shave. And the star of the party, since this is my eighth anniversary of wet shaving, eight years this week. Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements Cad. This is my all-time favorite scent. I think this is like my fourth or fifth puck of it. I'm not sure how many I've bought. But, uh, yeah. It's the ultimate barbershop scent. It's a 1970s version of Barber Soul, if you will, or Colgate Shave Cream in the can. And I'm going to finish it off with a matching aftershave splash and the methylated version of the Star Jelly. This stuff is crazy. So when I come back, I should be fully prepped and lathered up. So stand by. I will be right back, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, I'm back. Yogurt, anyone? Check out that lather. Good old Douglas Smith of Phoenix Arts and Accoutrements and France, his towel. And of course, the chief mascot, Huxley. <laughs> Back then, it used to be called How to Grow a Mustache and Pedal Pushers Fancies. Twig. First with a mustache area, and I got one of these in there. Fifth shade on this blade. Uh, anyway, back then, those Pedal Pushers Fancies and How to Grow a Mustache. I came in when there was a version 1.5. Douglas had gotten, just gotten, he really had just uh, gotten started and was just getting ready to take off. And uh, Francis was a, her own company before they merged. And she had pedal pushers, pedal pushers fancies, and uh, Brown Rabbit was one of her folks since the most popular since. Fifth shave on this blade too, by the way. And as you can see, wow, wow, heck yeah, I love it, I love it, I love it. No pulling, no tugging, and it's the fifth shave in a row on it. Sweet. Ladies and gentlemen, I believe I have met my go-to blade. Huh. Awesome. Plus, back when I started, there was only two guys, actually three, that were making videos back then. Geo Fat Boy of ShaveNation.com. Anthony Esposito, the stallion. And Nick Shaves, Nick Shroud of Nick Shaves. I don't even know. If 
That is annoying. Uh, I don't even know if Nick Shaves is still doing shave videos or not. Last time I checked, he wasn't doing too many. And what uh, he was uh, doing his residency, he's a doctor now, I believe. Anthony quit for a while and then came back, quit for a while and then came back, and I guess he's still doing them. I caught one of his videos not long ago. Let's see. Oh, yeah, uh, that's another thing I remember about uh, Douglas Smith. Soaps was, they wasn't in a plastic jar, they was in the tins. All right, when I come back, I should be, uh, fully cleaned up and finished up and go from there. Stand by. I will be right back, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, I'm back. That was a nice, clean shave. That's definitely the last shave on that blade. It tried to quit cutting on me, but it didn't pull or tug, but I was still able to get five shaves on the blade, so that's a good thing. I believe I've met my go-to blade now, ladies and gentlemen. My supply injector hasn't come in yet, and it hasn't shipped. It won't ship till the 7th. So, we should be good in a couple days, and it could take a week to get here, so. But, uh, other than that, that'll probably be my last mail call. Lord knows I've done enough of them in the past eight years. All right, let's recap. I prepped my face off camera with the Barbasol 1919 Leatherless Shave Cream. This is always going to be in my shave cave, no matter what is a pre-shave. I don't care where I go or what, but yeah. I went with my Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements 26mm Synthetic Atomic Rocket Brush. I went with the Leaf and Twig Sculptor and Razor. Fifth and final shave, whoops, on one of these uh, Strangelet Platinum Blade, Platinum Strangelet Blades from Phoenix Artists and Accoutrements. This is their own branded blades. Very nice. Five shaves on one blade for me. And I got a tough beard, so yeah. And they're comfortable from the word go. So that makes it more interesting. And the star of today's party, an old classic favorite of mine. I've had it for years. Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements Cab Classic Barbershop Scent. Can shave cream from the 70s type scent. And I'm going to finish it off with first the matching aftershave splash. If you haven't had one of these aftershave splashes, get you one. They last for hours. Is that is 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 after their aftershaves are almost like colognes. I kid you not. They last for hours. Alright, let's see what we got here. Burn on this is gonna be good. <laughs> oh yes. <coughs> And as you can see, the alcohol turned my face blood red now. So it's burning. It'll be gone in about 30 minutes. And to add a little touch of menthol and to get a double dose of this fantastic scent, the matching Star After State uh, Star Aftershave Jelly with menthol in there. <laughs> Don't take much. Light first, let it evaporate, and then put the bomb on last. Mm. Very nice. Mm, 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 mm.
All right. Thank you for watching, and I will see you guys next week. Take care, and God bless. Later.